Chinky's drawing class. Gattu and Chinky were growing up, and thus their subjects were also increasing. The subjects that were earlier optional for both of them in school have now become compulsory. The name of that subject was drawing. Chinky was very fond of drawing, but whenever Chinky heard the name of drawing, she used to get tensed because her drawing skills were not so good. and because of that she got scolded once a few days back in chinky's class while sir was taking drawing come on children today we will learn how to make a picture of peacock okay all the children were looking carefully towards their teacher everyone's attention was on the teacher but chinky was drawing something different and suddenly the teacher said so who will draw on the blackboard chinky you come here Chinky was not paying attention. So how could she make the drawing? She accepted her mistake and told the teacher, "Sir, I was drawing something different. I was not paying attention when you were teaching." Then what? The teacher scolded Chinky, and then Chinky decided that she would definitely learn how to draw a peacock. Chinky loved drawing. She just needed to learn a little. Gattu Chinky came back home from school. Gattu started laughing loudly and Chinky got upset. That's when mom came. Kids, no more fun. Mom, Gattu is teasing me about my drawing. Why Gattu? You should not do that. Mom, she could not make peacock. Chinky, don't worry. I have an idea. I'll get you an admission in rainbow drawing classes. Don't worry. That's why Chinky's mood was down. But as soon as mom told about drawing class, Chinky became happy. Mom had seen that. After this, both Gattu Chinky got admission in the drawing class. The name of the class was Rainbow Drawing Class. On reaching the class, all the children were looking excited because their drawing class was going to start from today. Everyone had smiles on their faces and everyone was showing respective things they had brought. Look, look. I have bought watercolors. What colors do you have, Gattu? I have pencil colors. Look how many colors it has. I have bought wax colors. I love filling colors in painting. All the friends were showing colors to each other and were telling their plans. Bhushan had brought water colors, so he took out the brush from his bag and he started showing it to the whole class. Dun dun dun. And this is my weapon, a brush with which I will make different drawings. Immediately after that, Gattu took the brush in his hand and said, "This is a very good brush, Bhushan. Wow! I will also make drawing from it. That to Aladdin's lamp." Everyone was enjoying a lot, but Chinky, who always used to jump here and there, today she was sitting calmly. So Gattu asked her, "Chinky." Which drawing will you make? Chinky did not answer anything. It seems that Chinky forgot to draw. Children started laughing loudly in the class, and only then the head who teaches drawing reaches there. The sir who used to teach in Rainbow Class was really famous for teaching drawing. As soon as he came, he started talking to the children. Hello, kids. How are you all? From today, I am your drawing teacher. Okay. So now like I told my name everyone will tell their name and also tell me what all they like to draw one by one the children were telling their names and at the same time they were saying the name of the thing they wanted to draw Gattu said I want to draw Aladdin's lamp after that Bhushan said I want to draw a ship floating in river Everyone told different things and as soon as Chinky's turn came she went silent so sir said tell me chinky what do you like to draw hey don't be afraid here we all are your friends sir i like drawing very much but i don't know how to draw i feel afraid that i will draw bad drawing <laughs> what is there to be afraid of chinky i will teach you how to make perfect drawings The thing was that the drawing sir got to know from Chinky's mother that she is very smart in all the other subjects. She knows how to draw. 
but make her sharp in drawing. So Sir told Chinky in the class, Chinky, come here. Chinky, I have heard that you are good in all the subjects, aren't you? But Sir, I find drawing very difficult. But you like drawing, don't you? Yes. See, nothing is hard or tough and whatever we like is not hard at all. If we work diligently, study diligently, then all hard things become easy. Just like that drawing. Do one thing, make a drawing the way you can and bring it to me tomorrow. When Gattu Chinki come home after the class, mom asks, Gattu Chinki, how was your drawing class? We all had brought different colors and you know Bhushan had brought a brush for colors and we have to draw something in homework also. You tell Chinki? Yes mom, it was fun. Sir is also very good. He explained everything to me. Now Chinki's face did not have the same despair and fear. She was also looking very excited. Mom understood that Chinki's fear about drawing was over. Later, Gattu and Chinki made their own drawings and the next day took it to the class. Sir showed both of their drawings to everyone. All the kids will applaud for Gattu and Chinki. As soon as Sir said, there was an echo of applause in the whole class. Gattu not only makes good drawings, but Chinki who was afraid of drawing till yesterday has also made very good drawings. From that day onwards, Chinki never felt scared of the drawing subject. Drawing subject which seemed difficult at first became easy for Chinki. Very good Chinki. Now just keep making different drawings like this. Yes sir. Thank you sir. Because of you now I can also make good drawings. After that when the children's exam took place, Chinki got good marks in drawing. She got the highest marks. In this way, Chinki's drawing became even better after joining Rainbow Drawing Class. And after that, Chinki made many drawings. If you are liking our videos, then like them, comment them and subscribe.